Well, I am going to the National Corvette Museum in Bowling Green, Kentucky today. It's about a 45 minute ride up from home and uh, here we go. It's a little underwhelming. I was hoping there would be more, but uh, it's pretty much just some model Corvettes. I mean, they're cool and all, but oh, <laughs> I think I went the wrong way. Yeah, this is much better. Uh, I've never been like a car guy. I mean, I appreciate cars. I certainly love driving them. They're very convenient, but I can't talk cars. It's a 69 Manta Ray Corvette, a second generation. Corvette uh, Stingray with the Mako Shark two more pronounced fenders. There you can see it says Manta Ray. So I was talking to somebody the other day who's from Bowling Green and they said you should come to the Corvette Museum. You'll also see the sinkhole in the Sky Dome. And I said, uh, so what, it just happened to coincidentally have a sinkhole inside of a dome? And then I was joking because I said, well, no, obviously, they built the dome around it and made it kind of a destination. Like, come see the, the sinkhole at the National Corvette Museum. No, that big, weird looking proctological exam for giants, that was already there and had Corvettes in it. And a sinkhole happened inside of it. And the cars fell in. And you can kind of see there was news coverage of it. And it, it yeah, it opened up right in this, big hall and uh, see so I go back here to go into it and they 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 filled it in it's covered it's nowhere to be found there's no sinkhole I thought they just would have left it <laughs> Disappointing. Oh, oh wait, wait, wait. Okay, well, I stand partially corrected, I guess. Um, you can kind of see the sinkhole. If you stand over this thing and look down into the, uh, the abyss down there. But, I mean... It's somewhat of a rip. Now I just gotta sit and look at these cars. There's a little red Corvette. Prince, okay. It's not red, but it's little. Well, that one's little. 